The search in the jungles of Kakita and Guaviara finally bore fruit the four miners appeared alive after 40 days in which nothing was known about their whereabouts the traces of food remains elements that were taken from the aircraft were key to the search for the four children throughout these 40 days each one of these pieces of evidence became a dose of hope for all rescuers and millions of Colombians who were anxiously awaiting the news of their whereabouts each of these pieces of evidence became a dose of hope for all the rescuers and millions of Colombians who were anxiously awaiting waiting the news that the children had survived in the that the children had survived in the dense jungle of Guaviare the children were immediately transferred to an airbase in San Jose del Guaviare where they will be received by emergency personnel where they will be received by emergency personnel to evaluate their state of health this news is quickly spread all over the net with the following headlines headlines of the main media miracle in the jungle this is how they found alive the children lost in the Guaviare miracle this is how it was heard this Friday in the communication Communications. The internal communications of the military who were looking for the four miners missing since May 1st in the Guaviare jungle and Kakita. Let's see the children's grandmother talking to the different media and thanks to the internationals. I am going to embrace all four of them and I am going to give thanks for all that already. I am going to give thanks for all that already. I have already recovered my daughter's bone and with the pain that I was in, I am going to cheer him up. I am going to go ahead and I am going to need him here. I hope I want to hug him right now. I want to hug my little girl. Next, let's observe the rescue operation and how they were taken out of the area by the military forces and the rescue group according to information shared by the military forces a helicopter arrived at the point where the children Leslie Mukuchuai were found helicopter arrived at the point where the miners Leslie Mukuchuai 13 years old and 9 years old were found 4 year old Noriel and Christina the baby who celebrated her first birthday in the middle of the jungle the children were initially attended to by combat medics from the special operations command who had been in the jungle. Special Operations Command that had been deployed in the area, but they were transferred to the San Jose del Guaviara military base, where they will later be taken to the San Jose del Guaviara military hospital, will be transferred to the military hospital in Bogota to continue with their recovery. Since last May 1st when the plane in which they were being transported fell in the middle of the jungle of Guaviara and Caquita. For five weeks more than 150 uniformed members of the army and several men from the indigenous indigenous community, among them, the father of the children, carried out a search block that day and night. They were trying to track the children in the thick forest grandparents of children celebrating and sharing their first statements to the media. There is no way to sigh with joy in the midst of tears and pure happiness. The grandparents of the children lost in the jungle of Guaviara reacted to the miraculous discovery of the little ones emphasized that the 13-year-old minor supported her three little brothers' republic. With the support she did and with the indigenous peoples of different, I have no way to thank her because the word thank does not fit, but forgive me, I am very happy, I am very happy, I am very happy as the grandfather of the four grandchildren that my daughter has already passed away, I also thank the company that gave me the body of my daughter that I went to keep in my territory, and then I am here in the city of Villa Vicencio as the grandfather of the four children that found her, I need them to come to me to deliver or to see him here in Villa Vicencio, Don Narciso, do you want them to be delivered here in Villa Vicencio or to bring them to you in the first place, I want to see my grandson here in Villa Vicencio and then to be transferred to the city of Bogota, Don Narciso, police inspector who lives in our department in Araquara, Kakita, and then it was confirmed by Mrs. Marta who dispatches the aircrafts that land in Araquara and then Henry Guerrero called the police inspector who lives in our department in Araquara, Kakita, and then Henry Guerrero called my wife Fatima telling her that they had already found the four children safe and sound the happiness overwhelms you were upstairs in the room did not want to go down because they were crying with his wife Mrs. Fatima who was there with us means the emotion is very great is that they are 40 days that were missing I thank all those people all my family all that supported me too and I thank them for their support I would like to thank all those people who are supporting me and who came to visit me I would like to talk to the UN and I would like to tell them to give me the custodian of my four children I am very grateful to those people in the international community all those people who support me the ICB also supports me I hope you continue to support us I hope you do not leave us Mrs. Fatima you spoke to her in that language in the language of your indigenous people what is that language and what message did you give the children so that they would not move forward in the jungle so that they would remain static I think so because they were swimming the same lap I think so because they were already feeling exhausted thank you my god she is a very warrior child of truly as the mother was like that we are so I am very grateful to my granddaughter Lely who supported those three little brothers and sisters that she is on the other hand the big question is where is Wilson the dog that disappeared looking 
for the children the canine that is part of the special forces initially found a shelter where they would have found the children. Initially found a shelter where they would have been the children but then disappeared mysteriously was with them for now the last thing that was. Official sources have told us that Wilson was not with them at the time of the rescue and did not appear. In the next hours we will be attentive to inform you what may happen with the scavenger dog Wilson to all the viewers who were attentive video by video of the outcome of